Sam. What do you make your team's performance this afternoon? Um, I was pleased. I, I was pleased with a lot of it, um, but I still think that we can be even better. Still, uh, probably a lot better in certain certain areas of the game. Certain things that we did in the game. I thought after the first ten minutes, um, when we got to grips with their formation, because they changed formation to what they've, they've played all season, really. Um, and obviously we were playing a different formation in terms of, I know we did it last week, but I think I said in the press through the week, this was against obviously stronger opposition. Um, and then after the first 10 minutes when we got to grips with it, I thought we were really, really good first half. And we could have had three or four goals by half time, to be fair. And then second half in periods of the game, I thought we played quite well at times, but we probably weren't as consistent with the ball and little decisions at time. I know we scored the goals, but I think I've said all along about we're looking for at performance levels because it's really important. That'll win your games as well. And obviously the way they try and play, they put you under pressure, they keep putting long throws in the box, they're playing for set plays. So we had to be, that's probably that's why we made the changes where we did to try and obviously deal with that as well. But at the end of the day, obviously we having you said it more than anyone about we, we want to win games sometimes rather than results. So to win 4-2 at home like we did, I'm really pleased. You go a goal down pretty early on. Almost two down as well, Adam Bartlett and the mixture of Adam Bartlett and the defender saved you. Yeah. Is that the, the pleasing thing that your team could have maybe gone under on yeah. another day this afternoon? Because the crowd are getting a little bit restless, but you came back really well. Yeah, I was really pleased with that. It just shows the character of the players, really. And yeah, we could have, like you say, we could have gone 2-0 down at that time. And, and we did start the game slow. And I think in previous games, that's probably one of the things that we've been really good at, starting games quite quickly. Um, but as you say, the players reacted to that, they showed good character, they good, showed good mental toughness and then we, got, we were really strong after that. Right, We didn't really want half-time to come because I thought, obviously with the chances that we had, you think get a goal now and, and hopefully we'll be really comfortable after that, but it come quite late in the game really. Um, but as I say, we, we, we're really pleased. Macaulay Langstaff was named part of the match, I saw the reaction on the bench as well, everyone slapping him on the back. Yeah. People probably see that he came off, but it doesn't really tell half the story. How pleased are you with the work effort, with the work rate that he's putting in, and the fact that he chases lost causes that, in effect, got you that equalising goal? Yeah, that's how he is every single day. He's a brilliant kid with a brilliant attitude. He comes in every day. He just wants to get better and better and better. And the way he goes about the game on the pitch, he, he'll, he'll chase lost causes, like you say. And I think sometimes you know, he's only a young player, but this, the older lads actually follow him because of the way that he is. And he, he makes a big difference to us in terms of what he offers us with his pace and his endeavour and work rate. And he's, as I say, he's a great kid. You changed it was obviously the same team as what you, what you played last week. That, that must have been an easy decision for you, was it? Uh, it, was quite, it was quite difficult because we weren't sure. We knew, we knew Liebert had been injured, we knew about Oddie J as well. Um, we were a little bit concerned, you know, either trying to protect them a little bit by taking them off. And they took him off after 20 minutes, Liber, last week, but we thought, are oh, they doing that precautionary, thinking about this week? So we were a little bit worried in terms of that. Um, but the way that they actually set up to play when we'd watched them previously, they played kind of a 4 5 1. So we thought it suited us perfectly with Sean stepping out on one side and, and Josh stepping out on the other, like we did last week. Um, there was. Two, two or three times in the game where we've said to the the right and left side of the centre match to go and join in, they're actually in the 6 yard box. And obviously Sean's got two goals as well, so <laughs> could call me, a, call me a tactical genius or whatever it is, but one of our centre halves has scored two goals today, so no, we'll take that, we're pleased. Of course, of course. <laughs> Def defensively, looked a little bit shaky, I thought, at times. Maybe more yeah. today than what it has done in previous games. Yeah, I think so, yeah. And I think a lot of that come maybe because of the way they play, you know, they're constantly putting you under pressure, they're returning balls, putting crosses in. Um, they probably played more football than what we've actually seen them play previously. That not, It's not just being disrespectful, it's that actually their style and it's been effective. They've only lost once since the beginning of the season, so we knew we were in for a really tough game today and they play with a lot of energy. So we had little moments, like you say, that we thought maybe not being as solid as what we had them previously. And, we're six weeks, seven weeks down the line into what we've been actually working on. So we'll get little times like that, but as, we, as I said previously, we're really pleased, but there's, there's still things that we can get better at. Just a couple more questions. You chose not to have a goalkeeper on the bench today. Was that, yeah. was Ryan fit? Is he in? Yeah, no, he's fine. It was just more of a, a tactical thing and we wanted to give us ourselves probably more options on the bench just by having that extra outfield player. Um, is that something you see going going forward? Yeah, going yeah, yeah. Um, that's something that I think I've said before. I'm not afraid to change things around, whether it be in the team, the bench, 
when I, when I pick a team, I'm also thinking about the subs and, and what can actually change the game and win us a game. So, and we thought five outfield players today gave us really good options in terms of Hamza. We, could, we knew we could bring him on and deal with the physical side of it. Um, we've got John who could come on, and obviously we know what John's all about. And then we get Wes with his legs. We've got Wright with his legs. So, and then obviously Sean, uh, sorry Russ with his experience in midfield and managing the game really well, which he did for us when he came on. So that that was the big reason why we just thought it'd give, it'd give us plenty of options. The other lads that went off, any any injury concerns? Was Griffiths okay? No, everyone's fine. Everyone's fine. Yeah, it was just like I say the way they would what they were doing when they'd gone four one down, three one down and keep putting balls back into our box. We wanted to bring Hamza on. Um, Josh is probably a little bit more experienced at this level and games under his belt and that's why we obviously moved him one higher up the pitch instead of Callum. But there's no injuries or anything like that, everyone's fine, which is good. And I'm not on the league table yet, but obviously a win's going to move you up a couple of places, I would have thought, and it's the perfect start to a, to a big week. Yeah, that, I think that's what we said the other day about how important it was now that we, we wanted to, when games come thick and fast when you're playing Saturday, Tuesday, if we can come out of that and we've had two, two really positive results, it sets us up for on Saturday. So we've done the first part of the job now we've got to make, make sure that we recover properly we'll be in tomorrow to do all the right things to prepare us for Tuesday and hopefully we can go and put in a performance like that on, on Tuesday like we've done today and come away with another really good result. That's